here with a lapsit with Loki. Since we're at home, I thought I would do a lapsit with my dog Loki. He offered very generously to take Harry's place, doing all of the fun rhymes and stuff that we do normally for Brilliant Babies. So just like with Brilliant Babies, we're going to start out with our hello song, Hickety Pickety Bumblebee. This is a great song to do. Not only does it help me and everybody else learn your name, but also we're spelling your name, which is very, very important. Great way to start learning your letters. Um, as we spell, I invite you to trace the letters on baby's back, and we're going to clap the syllables and whisper their name as well. So this is how it goes. Loki, are you ready? Okay. Hickety pickety bumblebee, who can say their name for me? What's your name? Loki. Let's spell it. All right. L O K I. All right. Now we need to clap it. Loki. And then we're going to whisper it. Loki. Good job. All right, friends. It's your turn. Here we go. Hickety pickety bumblebee, who can say their name for me? What's your name? And can you spell it? Now let's clap it. And let's whisper it. All right, friends, next we're going to do one of my favorite rhymes. It's bumping up and down in a little red wagon. Now I like to do rhymes because rhyming, especially the bouncing to of the rhythm, really helps baby understand language, breaks it down very well in that phonological awareness. So get your kiddo on your lap and let's start bumping. Bumping up and down in my little red wagon. Bumping up and down in my little red wagon. Bumping up and down in my little red wagon. Won't you be my darling? Loki loves doing lap sets. All right, my friends. Now that we've bumped up and down a little bit, let's go up a hill. Now this one's for all of my grown-ups out there who need an ab workout. We're gonna lean back and we're gonna go up a hill. Going up a hill in my little red wagon. Going up a hill in my little red wagon. Going up a hill in my little red wagon. Won't you be my darling? All right, we've gone all the way up that hill, but we're starting to rock side to side. Here we go. Rocking side to side in my little red wagon. Rocking side to side in my little red wagon. Rocking side to side in my little red wagon. Won't you be my darling? Great job, guys. That was fun, wasn't it, Loki? Next, we need to get ready to read our book. And I have a fun rhyme that gets you ready for this, but also teaches the vocabulary of reading a book. We adults tend to forget that we had to learn words like cover and pages. So, with friend in your lap, mine is going to have a snack right now and a little bit of a nap. I think we wore him out. Put your hands together in front of you like two covers of a book and this is how it goes. Let's take a look at this book. Here is the cover. We open it wide. Here are the pages hidden inside. There are words and there's pictures and we look and we look and when we are finished, we close up the book. One of my favorite books to read with any age group is Brown Bear, Brown Bear, What Do You See? by Eric Carle. This is a fantastic opportunity for building vocabulary. The words on the page are very simple, but you as an adult can describe more of what you're seeing. And as your child grows, that those words can become more and more complex. So please follow along at home. Brown bear, brown bear, what do you see? Brown bear, brown bear, what do you see? 
I see a red bird looking at me. Red bird, red bird, what do you see? I see a yellow duck looking at me. Yellow duck, yellow duck, what do you see? I see a blue horse looking at me. Blue horse, blue horse, what do you see? I see a green frog looking at me. Green frog, green frog, what do you see? I see a purple cat looking at me. Purple cat, purple cat, what do you see? I see a white dog looking at me. We've got our own white dog today. Ready? White dog, white dog, what do you see? I see a black sheep looking at me. Black sheep, black sheep, what do you see? I see a goldfish looking at me. Goldfish, goldfish, what do you see? I see a teacher looking at me. Teacher, teacher, what do you see? I see children looking at me. Children, children, what do you see? We see a brown bear, a red bird, a yellow duck, a blue horse, a white dog, a purple cat, a green frog, a black sheep, a goldfish, and a teacher looking at us. That's what we see. Well, friends, thank you very much for joining me in a little Laps It with Loki virtual story time. I'm going to be uploading several other ones of them, so feel free to come back and rewatch. Rereading the same books is one of the best things you can do for your kiddos, so don't feel bad if you keep rewatching the same ones. Thank you for joining me.